Contractors, here's three easy tips to make sure you never have to deal with a subcontractor again. Number one, you wanna call that subcontractor and instead of talking about inspirational photos or details, job site location, yada, 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 you wanna go ahead and start talking about price right out of the gate. And you wanna try and get the price down as cheap as possible. Even though you don't know what the fuck it is you're looking for, just try and get it cheap, cheap, cheap. And just when you think you've hit bottom, squeeze them some more so you can get every blood out of that rock that you can possibly extract. Number two, you wanna use fear. You wanna call and hopefully you catch someone that's new in the company or new to the industry and just scare the shit out of them. Be very curt, uh, use an angry tone of voice and just try and scare the shit out of them and hopefully they'll feel like, oh, I pissed them off, I'll give you a cheaper price. Number three, you wanna call and leverage potential opportunities for your business to help garner a better price on the front end, even though it's probably never gonna happen, so just lie. And here's a fourth one, this is a bonus. This is a bonus, because I said there was only three. Call the subcontractor and ask for shop drawings before you engage in any type of agreement. That way, you could take those shop drawings and shop them around for all the competition and probably find a better price. So you just completely waste your time. If you don't want to use any of those tips, then I encourage you to call My Architectural Glass. We would be happy to help.